great innovator. Bill, you own CrowdStrike. Yeah, I prefer we, that over. Yeah, this we one. we like the name a lot. Um, timing was great for us before before the S and P inclusion news. Uh, we added on confirmation after earnings as well. Mm-hmm. Um, the ARR is just continuing to be a behemoth for them. I think it's going to yeah. continue as they get that recurring revenues going. They're twenty five twenty twenty five expected thirty percent year over year revenues. So I, I love the name. I think uh, maybe it settles in a little bit here. I'm not expect maybe some gains pulled forward after that news on the mm-hmm. S&P, though. What about Tesla today? Reiterated outperform uh, by Super Bowl Dan Ives at Wedbush. 275 is the price target. AI story, he says that Tesla's, quote, the linchpin to $1 trillion market cap tide shifting. Do you think the tide is shifting? Yeah, I, I would never go against Dan Ives, especially in a name like Tesla. I, I think the, the peak negativity that, that we saw around Tesla's earnings is not there anymore, but I think it's settling out. I think we're seeing nice technical bottoming pattern. I wouldn't be, be surprised to see this above 200 in the very, very near future. I'm going to be trading this personally probably with some options down the road here in the near future. But the AI story around it, not, I don't look at it just, just a car company. I think there's an AI story, there's potential software story, the, the charging station story. There's a lot of factors here that could power this thing over $200 in the very near term. You would think to buy more, you say? Yes. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not there yet. There's maybe some broad market concerns, but maybe by the end of the month or around the, you know, the 4th of July time. All right, Freeport, upgraded to overweight from...